guys, and happy fundraising Friday. I'm Eric. The best way to be overlooked is to generalize your fundraising messaging. People want to know the why of what you're doing. They want to know why you're collecting shoes, as well as your what. Specifically, what is your goal and what are you trying to accomplish? The more specific you can be, the better off your supporters will be in knowing the impact they're creating by collecting these gently worn, used, and new shoes. So be very specific in communicating your message. For example, you could say, your parent-teacher group is collecting shoes. Donate yours today! Versus, our parent-teacher group is collecting 25 bags of shoes. Each bag will have 300 shoes in them. The shoes will be used to create and help micro-businesses in countries such as Ghana, Honduras, Tanzania. And in these countries, work opportunities are scarce. Our parent-teacher group will also receive $3,000 to help support youth camps in the process. You can help by dropping off 25 pairs of shoes to our location by the deadline date. Donate yours today! Now, which of those really sounds better? The clearer and more direct your message, the better your supporters will be in understanding exactly what they're doing and how they're helping not only you, but the world in general. Connect with your fundraising coach to discuss this tip or follow our blog and get weekly fundraising tips. We are here to help. Once again, my name is Eric. Thank you for joining us on Fundraising Friday. Make sure you follow us on Facebook and on YouTube. And until then, happy collecting. That's not good. All kinds of others. All right, this will take me 40 minutes to do this one minute video. You did it!